So what I'm doing right now, I'm just describing for you what I want you to do, and then I'll give you your cats, and then you do it, okay? My good friends, uh, so uh, w w what you want to do first y is identify where this levator scapulae, and it's going to be in the same area, around about roughly the same area, so that's where you're going to look, you understand? First, so don't go anywhere else except that. You first look here, so the club of trapezius, trapezius covers the levator scapulae like that, and they're all sort of thin, bands of muscle. So you want to peel the clavotrapezius trapezius off first, okay? Uh, so you work on that area first using your blunt probe and uh, your blunt end scissors, sometimes using your sharp end to just pick on that connective tissue. Make sure you're only picking on the connective tissue, not the muscle. Okay, once you separate here, you go all the way to the neck. You just kind of go here. By the time you got to the neck, uh, it will mostly be muscle, uh, but you got to follow the same line. And then the, over here, there's going to be muscle again, so you're going to cut through that a little bit. Right in the center, see there's the connective tissue already. And then you cut the connective tissue between the acromiotrapezius, trapezius, acromiotrapezius, trapezius on that side. But you've already made sure that the opening, the incision on the abdomen is on the other side, and you are doing the other side. Okay, you've already done that. Okay, so you do that, and then once you do that, uh, you can free up some more space here uh, and some more space here so that you can now come down here, okay? So you cut the connective tissue that is attaching this uh, acromiotrapezius to the spinal trapezius, trapezius, right? You do that, and then here, like I said, there's going to be tough connective tissue connecting that, so you kind of work th through this. Make sure you separate this spinal trapezius, trapezius from the latissimus dorsi, latissimus dorsi before you cut, don't be cutting through both of them like that, don't do that I've seen that happen, believe it or not even after saying this profusely <laughs> you see what I'm saying, so don't do that my good friends okay, you want to do that, once you separate this spinal trapezius, trapezius then you've room to kind of go to your latissimus dorsi, latissimus dorsi Okay, and, uh, and and then you, you do that, and then you just finish this off. You just follow the line here, and just noting that at the junction of the clavotrapezius, trapezius, and the clavodeltoid, deltoid, there's going to be this tough connective tissue, so you want to work through, as well as avoiding the blood vessel, if you see it right there, you understand? And that, that's all you're doing today. This, that, this, and then. That, that's it. That's what I'm going to give you time to do, and you can go as far as you can, okay? Um, and... Uh, then after that, I'll do another video to cut through the arm, okay? So, so we can switch this one off.